Well, for all of those who love picking up those Ripley books and finding out who's the next person in their list of bizarre things, who's doing things the longest, who's setting records, we gotta tell you, the book Beyond the Bazaar is out from Ripley's, and we've got a couple of guests with us. We've got Sabrina, is it Seek? Seek, yes. Seek, who's with us. And in just a couple of seconds, we're gonna introduce to you Jane Labowitz, who is AKA Princess Etch-a-Sketch. So come on in, Princess Etch-a-Sketch. Sit right down, because it is really a pleasure to meet you. Oh my gosh, thank How you are so you? Much. Sit I'm right great. down. How are you? We've loved these since we were kids. Absolutely. And I've been a kid a long time ago. You have found a way to do this super fast, and that's what got you in the Ripley's book. Yep. Yep. Tell me what, how you do this and how long you've been doing this. So I have been drawing on an Etch-a-Sketch for, gosh, over 20 years now. Uh -huh. And it's something that I've just been like, I picked it up as a kid and I never even really thought that it was something difficult to do until I got older. And uh, yeah, I could do things for as quick as like five minutes for something to up to like 20 hours for my most detailed work. Wow, I hope you're taking pictures of them because all somebody's got to <laughs> just come by and go and right? it, we're done, right? Oh yeah. That's incredible. Can you, can you do my name real quick? Linda? Sure, All right, absolutely. Let's see how fast you do so that. So let's see. I will start in a good spot here. And they're still making extra sketches, right? Oh, yeah. Now, Sabrina, tell yes. me about the book that um, Jane is in. Yeah, so it's the 16th edition of Ripley's Believe It or Not Annual called Beyond the Bazaar. 256 pages of all new, all true stories. So we've got amazing talents like Jane, but also an armless archer, a painting squirrel, a cat with 26 toes, everything you have to see to believe. And actually what's also unbelievable is Jane can actually do this with blindfolded usually as yeah. well. Wow. Which blows my mind. What have you got? Oh, well, here you, you go. In script she did it. They're yep. not even teaching this anymore. <laughs> this is amazing. This is amazing. What's the what most complicated picture you ever did? So I have one right here that I'll show. All right, Let let's this see. This is one of my more detailed renditions oh of my. Starry oh Night. Oh my gosh. Yeah. That's awesome. I always had a problem just going in a <laughs> circle with these things. And look at, look at, it's filled with circles. It's beautiful. The artist himself would be very, very pleased. Oh, that's well, amazing. Thank you. <laughs> amazing. And, and how many hours did you say? So that one probably took around 10 hours About to do. 10 yep. hours. How many of these do you own? Oh, gosh, probably over 300 in my home at any wow. given time. I go through a lot. Do, yeah. you, do you do personal appearances and, and do these in front of audiences? Oh, yeah. 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 I teach workshops. I do live renditions. In fact, I will be doing a live rendition just right now of uh, the logo. So. Okay. Fantastic. Yeah. All right. You know what's really great about this? It, it, uh, it improves your dexterity. Oh, for sure. You know what I mean? Because you really have to watch. you gotta, you got to have left hand working with right hand. Mm -hmm. For sure. You know? For this sure. is great. There's definitely some people in the book that can't do that, though. We've got Mr. Chalal from India who had the world's largest fingernails. Oh, so, I think I've seen that guy. Yeah, it's yeah. pretty wild. So Ripley's actually flew him over from India, and we cut his nails. They're now on display at our New York Auditorium. Oh, boy! Look at this. He was also a national press photographer. So with the world's longest nails, still snapping photos professionally. Whoa. Where can we get the new book and, and all the Ripley books? Yeah, they're on sale at all major retailers, so including Amazon. And they're great for holiday gifts, even for reluctant readers. Just on your coffee table, pick it up. Now, if, if people feel that they can compete, can they still get in touch what, by reading the book? They'll find out mm -hmm. how to get in touch with Ripley's and, sure. and, and at least let you know what, what it is that they're doing. For sure. So we've got a team of researchers. So we're finding people ourselves, but we also have a submit your own, believe it or not, on our website, ripleys.com. So anyone's welcome to join. Wow, fantastic. All right, Jane, what have you got so far? Because we're right. almost out of time. I just finished up a quick version oh, of the logo. Oh, my yep. gosh. <laughs> it's there. There it is. Can you yep. work this fast on an etch sketch <laughs> It's amazing. Thank you, Jane. Congratulations. Oh, gosh, my pleasure. And thank you, Sabrina. Thank you. All right, pick up their book for the holidays. It's great reading, and it's an awful lot of fun to see about some really interesting people uh, out there in the world. Absolutely.